Well, I am Jake, um, but for our individual today, um, in the morning had a big read door, but it's got with my chair. Um, got breaking news right now about the Eden Manuel by election. Um, the state MP for Big uh, Andrew Conscience uh, announced in early afternoon I check online uh, on the ABC News website um, he announced that he um, seeking peace election for the Liberal candidate for Edemeneo um, this dramatic of the race right now is that the media saying even even the talk when John Barrio could run for the seat, the media saying the coalition, the Liberal Party or the National Party have a have an advantage. Um, with my um thinking of it is um looking before on Wikipedia the last time when a governor won a by election of a opposition party is just under one hundred years. The by election date policy of Kaluti in Western Australia is on the 18th of December 1920, the last time um, a, a, the government won a seat of the opposition. The sitting Labour MP was exposed. Um, got some um, different factors than a normal by-election. However, um, this by-election um, is really interesting because it is a historical marginal seat and was a bellwether seat up to the 2016 Australian election. Um, Andrew Constance have a natural advantage in the seat because he he is or going to be a outgoing transport means uh, in the guards big the biggest sense government. Um, and the people are one. Criminal and Bombala and yes, barely know him from the media um, conferences and news items on the on the state news. Then Chrissy McBean, the Labour candidate, and and Chrissy McBain um, was. Um, the mayor of Big Valley Side Council have a less powerful candidate in the race. Why Andrew Conscience have a natural advantage. But said all that um the the opposition have a natural advantage so before with the results uh, with the Barlex and the the Barlexans of majority of the time the governor apart from one Barlexan um, in Australian history um, the governor lose the seat or the governor retain the seat not gaining the seat of the opposition 
um, apart from one by Alexan. Um, comment down if I'm wrong about the statistic. Um, it's most likely that. Um, Andrew Concepts and Chrissy McBain um, have experienced during the best buyers um intercent and the have um have um have Sicily's having attacked the Mosin government um during the fire response. Um especially Andrew Constance attacking his own state governor and attacking the federal governor about the response of the bus fires have some appear in the election because is could be um copying as a opposition speaker in in the race and Chris McBain is running as the Labour candidate and and was um um the mayor of Big Valley Side Council C also is got a opposition factor um that is um the factors behind the two politicians right now and 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 also um if uh most likely who Andrew Conscience have um have peace elects um having um one um for for the Labour candidate and most likely who he unopposed and won peace election he have to resign as a state MP and will trigger a by-election in the city of Biga and we don't know um, the city of Biga is a natural uh, Labour Party seat and most likelihood the Labour Party will retain the city of Biga but if um, and if the um, People of Big Cup could be the people of the bigger electorate, I mean, could be annoyed having two by elections in a space of time. However, um, just before, um, on my lunch time, I look on ABC News, um, and it's reports saying that either Manel by election could cost the tax payers could be around two million dollars but that is the update for the by election in the city of Edemaneo uh having other updates on the weights of the city of Edemaneo and could be having the by election in the city of Bega. Thank you I am Jack Grace. Please, please like this video and comment down for suggestions of of new topics I um talking about in the future. Um, I will get more mental health and physical health um videos up soon. Thank you and goodbye.